I'm here with my super duper training buddies to show you how to do a superset for the back and the biceps. Now the for idea a super workout. That's right. Super set for <laughs> super workout. The idea behind a superset is to train two opposing muscle groups at the same time, or two complementary muscle groups such as the back and the biceps. Now Rosie's getting started off with the wide grip pull down. Notice her back is straight. She's leading with the elbows, keeping the back nice and straight, which is isolating the lats right in through here. Can we use the word super anymore? Is this super form? <laughs> We're going to see how many words you can super say. Super lap. Super. You look super. <laughs> All right. Super duper. You're doing a super job, Rosie. <laughs> That's super. <laughs> so where are the day? Let's come up with some new ones. Okay. <laughs> That's killer. <laughs> Wow, that's great. Oh, great. That's boring, but it, it works. Great. <laughs> you got that? Okay, we're going to start off with 10 to 15 repetitions of the pull downs, a couple more, then immediately go on into the bicep curls. 14, 14 and 15. 15. Great, Rosie. All right. So now we come on down here. Okay. Have a seat, madame. Now, again, she just finished doing the pull downs to the back and immediately going into the bicep curls. Now this is an excellent exercise to complement the back because when you're doing the pull downs, you're also getting some bicep work in there. Do you like yeah. super setting, Mark? Super sets are super duper. <laughs> no, really, I find that when we're doing it, you're right, you get not only the back workout and the bicep, but everything, the entire arm and the back seems to be working. I, I enjoy it. Oh, and it's faster. So you're doing two muscle groups at the same time. That's right. You go surfing sooner. Yeah. Oh, See, I knew I'd get him on that one. <laughs> okay, this is working the entire area of the bicep right in through here. She's keeping her elbows on the pad, the forearms doing all the work, pulling the weight in, curling it. Notice Mark spotting at the arm, the arm of the machine. This is all you, Rosie. I'm not even here. <laughs> I'm just barely touching it. Great. Okay. Now it's my turn. I've been having too much of a break. Yeah. Okay. That's work. Okay, <laughs> Mark's turn. Now, Mark, what weight do you want? I um, want to see you go heavier this time. What I'm first thing I'm gonna do is raise this because I have a little bit longer legs. Okay. Mark's gonna get started with his super set. First, you're starting off again with the back. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna go a little bit heavier. Okay. If you don't mind. Well, you know, it's, this is my big chance to show you two ladies what's going on. He's trying to impress them. Okay, notice here he's using the wide grip. Again, this is working the upper area of the lat right in through here. He's also getting some bicep work, which is warming up his biceps for the bicep curl. Now, when you're training with supersets, make sure you get proper rest in between to give your muscles time to recover. How long should you usually wait at the training? Um, maybe a minute, two minutes, get a drink of water, yeah. stretch out. That's a good question. And if I want to spot Good's Mark, that. I'm right here. If I actually needed a spot. Oh. No, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'll let you do it just to demonstrate. Okay, to demonstrate. Maybe we'll put some real weight on there next yeah. time. They need a spot. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I might have family watching, so okay. you have to make it look good here. That's great, huh, Lizzie? Yeah. Lock it out. Looking good. Okay, ready for your next half here, Super Set? Let's move it. Okay, the bicep curl. Now, I love Super Setting. You get more of, I think you get more of an intense workout because you're using two muscle groups at the same time. Mark has a real nice peak on his bicep. Hey, welcome. Got super bicep. <laughs> sure. Super. So this is getting the complete range of motion, letting the weight down slowly, curling it up, squeezing at the top. Perfect. Great. It's a real comfortable machine. Isolates the grain. Yeah, I like that machine. And one thing that's really nice about this machine, you've got the um, different range of motion selections that you can uh, put it on. Depending on your flexibility. Yeah. How long your arms are. <laughs> I got short little right. stubby arms. <laughs> okay. Three more. Come on, pump it up. Three. So for supersets, you want to keep your number of sets between 12 to 15 for the back Excellent. and 6 to 8 sets for the bicep. The champ. 
Well, you have my competition ago. now. Yeah. Okay. So I need to lower this adjustment a little. You want the top of the pad to hit the top of your thigh. Should I just spot me on this one? Sure. Behind. How do I be from behind? From behind? Sure. And you just put your hands on top of my hands. Oh, okay. There you go. You just help me down just a little if I need it. Yeah, I notice when I like to work out, like the other uh, two of us are doing, it's important that you keep the back really straight. Form is pretty much everything when you're working out. Keeps you from getting injured and helps to increase your workout. Yeah. That's why I like going the, doing the lighter weights until I, yeah. you know, learn how to yeah. do it. That's, that's the way I used to do it too. Start light. Don't let the weight control you. You control the weight. Exactly. And then you learn the good form. Whew. Nice Great. job. Hey, Thanks. Okay, now I'm moving on down here. I like to go from one exercise immediately to the next. Where do you like it? Three? Keeps me pumped. Yeah, 30 is great. Okay. Wow. The guns are firing. <laughs> they are. The little baby guns. <laughs> yeah, you definitely have a great definition on your biceps. Yeah. Thanks, Mark. The object of the bicep curl is to not only build a nice peak on the bicep, but also add overall strength to the muscle. It's about how you look and, most importantly, Longevity and how you feel. Feel good, guys? I feel pretty good. That's great. <laughs> you're actually making me tired this morning. I know. Okay, you're up next, Rosie. And whew. the lat pull downs widen the lower lats. Concentrate on letting the lats do the work, getting the full stretch at the top of the movement. Pump up your biceps with strict movement such as the seated machine curls. Because your elbows are in a fixed position, you get the fullest extension. We are just in time for our super workout. We're getting started with our supersets. Today we're supersetting biceps and triceps. And Chris is getting started with his um, seated dumbbell curls for the biceps and immediately going into the uh, skull crushers or eyeballs, or whatever you call them, for the <laughs> triceps. Don't really crush your skull. Yeah, don't crush your skull. Two more. Supersets are really great. I travel a lot and it really helps on time. You need to really get in there and get your workout done quick amount of time. That's a good point. Because right. you're going from one exercise immediately to the other. So Chris did, went from his seated dumbbell curls for the biceps. Now he's doing the skull crushers for the triceps. Great. Notice his form. He's got his back against the pad. And this is very important. He's keeping his elbow right directly over the shoulder, not dropping the forearm below 90 degrees. Spotters, you're right here at the devil. Never take the weight away from your partner. Just give him a little boost at the top. Great. Two more. A Hawaiian mosquito just got my back. <laughs> All right, good job. Okay, my turn. A lot of hotel gyms only have dumbbells too, so these exercises that we're showing you are really good if you do a lot of stuff. That's an excellent point. Excellent point. You can get an entire workout with the dumbbells. It's excellent because the bicep and the tricep are smaller muscles of the body, so you don't have to do as much work for them. They still get the same amount of benefit and need as much weight. Feet shoulder width apart. Curl the weight up. Elbows tight into the waist. I like to turn my pinkies at the top. Two more. Up. She needed a spot. I just come right behind you here. Help support the wrist. Good job. Young. Okay. Now again, we're supersetting, so I'm going on now into my triceps. And elbows up, tummy tight. Great. Great form. Extending up. Now, Chris, how often do you superset? I try to superset at least once a week, Brad, because it's just different than always training it one particular way. I'm working with different muscles at the same time. I prefer supersetting because I get a lot of cardiovascular from moving from one to the next. Sure. If you're not necessarily using the same band. And last one. Good job. A good point to remember is when you superset, try to pick opposing muscle groups. So we're starting here on the bicep and on the opposite side. 
me, it's a tricep. <laughs> Shannon's doing the bicep curl. Shannon, what I want you to do at the top is supinate your wrist in. There you go. What if I'm now? It puts a little more emphasis on the outer head of the, of the uh, bicep. It's a good idea also to stretch in between sets so you keep the blood flowing to the muscle, keep yourself warm when it's yep. your turn. And let me give you these. Now you may need to use a lighter weight when you do the um, when you do the tricep extension. It's a little more difficult. Keep the elbows still. And up. There you go. Perfect. Nice and slow. Great. They also call these the French press. Thank you. Can you press it? <laughs> <laughs> oui, monsieur. Je oh, you <laughs> um, I train each body part twice per week. A few more? Is that it? <laughs> that is it. <laughs> Thanks. Wow, you really and up. Last one. All right. Okay, so that's our that's a super set. We did dumbbell curls and skull crushers. Now I'll show you another tri another super set for the same body parts. We'll move on to the incline curls and the dip. Incline curls, leaning back on an incline bench, head back, curl the weight up. Basically, when you're on an incline bench, it just works the mice, the bustle, the bustle, the mice. The bustle, the bustle. <laughs> The bicep at a different angle. Chris, you're getting me all flustered. <laughs> it's my turn next, so I'm not going to say too much. Good job, Kiana. If she would need a spot, I would just come behind here and help support her at the forearms. So you get a few more extra reps out, get extra pump in. It's always a good idea to work out with the spotter, so you can work the muscle just a little bit harder than you could do on your own, and it's also safer. Good point. Safety first. Okay, super setting. So I did the uh, incline curls. Now moving on to the dips. The dips are a great way to finish out your tricep workout. Because you're using your own body weight as resistance. It's actually safer than doing a super set with weights. Good job, Jenna. more. Two, and last one. Chris's turn. Uh-oh. So if you're training at home, you can get this entire workout just with a pair of dumbbells. And another good superset in addition to the bicep and tricep would be the chest and the back. Chris has great arms. He does. He does this quite a bit. He has terrific arms. You can really see it working right in through here. Remember the incline bench works more of the upper head of the bicep. And that's about it for our super sets of biceps and, and triceps. The bicep muscle is responsible for lifting and curling the arm and also for the twisting motion in the wrists. The dumbbells allow you a greater range of motion allowing you to twist the wrists at the top of the movement and fully contract the muscles. Supersetting bicep curls with the tricep extensions is a fun way to train both muscle groups. The lying triceps extensions work the triceps all the way from the elbow to the lats. Remember to keep your elbows stationary and slowly lower the weight towards your forehead and return to the starting position. The incline dumbbell curls develop the mass and the bicep peak at the same time. If you do the movement to the front, it's a bicep movement, but if you angle your wrist outward, it's more of an inner bicep movement. Finish off your super set using your own body weight with tricep dips. Do three to four sets of each exercise and you'll have a super workout with super sets. sports on the beach. It's a great way to get some exercise, have some fun, and get a suntan.
Not so much talking, serve all the right, food. All right, all right. Beach volleyball requires a lot of jumping in the sand. Squats will help strengthen your quads so you can jump even higher over the net. Jumping rope is excellent for building your cardiovascular endurance and keeping you on your toes. And spike that volleyball even harder after a few sets of the tricep extensions. The back of the arm or the tricep area is a very easy muscle group to train if you know how. We're going to show you how to do the dip and the tricep kickback using the chairs, the Kiana body flex, the dumbbells, and Anita's using the ankle weight. Let's get started. Knees bent, lower yourself slowly, and one, two, elbow straight back, three, smile, four, <laughs> five, tummy tight, six, feet flat, seven, press it up, eight, Flex those triceps, nine, 10, perfect. 11, 12, make sure your elbows are going straight back. 13, last two, 14, and 15. Our second exercise is the kickbacks. Left foot forward, left hand resting on the left knee, right elbow up, palm facing back, Extend the arm, one, and two, three, four. Keep those tummies tight, five, six. Even flex the leg, seven, and the glutes, eight. Keep the elbow high, nine, ten. Five more, 11, 12, 13. Last two, 14, pump it out, and 15. Left arm, feel that, huh? Right leg forward, left elbow up high, palm back, and extend one, two, tighten the legs, three, chin up, four. Think how great we're gonna look after this. Five, six, seven, eight. Three to four sets is all you need. Nine, ten, five more. 11, 12, these are called tricep kickbacks. 13, last two, 14, and when you're done, you can kick back. Supersetting the back and the biceps are easy in the gym. The pull-downs add to the V-taper in the back that looks so great. Remember to keep the chest out and the back straight. Do one set of the pull-downs followed by one set of the seated machine curls. The machine curls add peak to the biceps. And add variety to your supersets with free weights. When people think of big arms, they usually think of the bicep, but actually the tricep is a larger muscle than the bicep. Get a complete arm workout by supersetting the triceps and the biceps with dumbbell curls and triceps extensions. Another great combination of exercises to superset the biceps and triceps are the incline curls. The incline curls add mass and peak to the bicep area. Keep the head back, back flat, curling the weight up in a slow, controlled movement. Finish off your superset with a set of the tricep dips. Energize your mind and your body with the game of volleyball or another favorite cross-training sport. Remember to take a lifestyle approach to fitness. Combine weight training, proper nutrition, cardiovascular activity, and focusing on ridding your body of trouble spots, just as we've shown you in our trouble spot segment. The dips are a great exercise for tightening and toning the back of the arms. So get the fitness advantage. Get in shape with us on Flex Appeal.
you'll look better and feel better too. We had an awesome workout today and we'll see you next time on Kiana's Flex Appeal. Kiana's Flex Appeal was filmed at the beautiful Ritz-Carlton Kapalua on Maui's lush northwest shore. Aloha!